I was down this morning. We had had a rain the other day, and uh, like an inch and a half. So I was down here disking with the David Bradley and the and the pumpkins and and all that. But you know, because it breaks up nice after a rain. When I got down here, as I was going around, I noticed I've had deer nibbling in the corn. <laughs> in the sweet corn. So what I got there's a, a lot of seed and sweet corn here. But still, you know, once they start on something like that, there's another spot down there where they did some nibbling too. Well, really all along here I can see every once in a while just take a little bite off. But this one spot they really worked her over. So I decided to go old school and give her a try with the scarecrow. So I dug through my old clothes and spent the morning putting together a scarecrow. So we'll see. We'll try it. It'll probably freak out the hikers because that's right on the other side of the fence is the North Country Trail. And also, every once in a while, they have to move cattle about once a month through that alleyway. And they might be a little reluctant, and of course FedEx and UPS are going to be puzzled by uh, somebody standing there. But I think it'll do the trick. Though I got the feeling the pockets are going to be full of sticks because wrens love to build in pockets. You know, so it'll be a wren habitat. But it should work. As long as the flying monkeys don't find it, 